The danger, the damage, the destitute, King Despot. Welcome, YouTube. Got another video here. Got some commentary this time. I'm not going to leave you guys just yet. But uh, I'm going to talk with you with about the patch, uh, which is patch 1.23. Uh, I'm going to go over that with you, some new details, and I got some airstrike footage for you. I also got the patch uh, notes up here on the screen. You can check that out, pause it if you need to. I'm not going to keep it on the screen forever. Uh, just want to show you so you can say that you saw it. Alright, so let's move on. Revives. Controversial. But it's here. You like it, you love it, you hate it, Two years. you don't like it. Which one is it? To me, it's all good, man. You gotta, you gotta find a way to keep the player base in here. But at the same time, I'm not about babying the, the player base as well. Because I'm a skilled player. And if it takes me time to get skilled, you can take your time and get skilled too. Can't go against the grain, baby. But anyways, these revives. Basically, all three of them. Once you knock a person down, you got they got 60 seconds before they can be uh, before they're fully terminated. And within that time, the health goes down exponentially. And you can damage them too, which I don't fully agree with. Once once I down a guy. I should have to put one bullet in them to kill them. You know, one or two. I still got to come up sometimes and hit you with the shotgun twice to finish you off. So that might be a total of five or six rounds for one guy. Uh, I don't fully agree with it, man. I don't fully agree with it. But, you know, like I said, something to keep the player base in here. But yeah, it takes 10 seconds to complete the revive on your friendly when he's down. And during that time, you cannot look around or do anything. You're vulnerable. Very, very vulnerable. But one thing I don't like about it, though, is that there's no indication for a person that's being downed. You need to let me know. Also... I want the kill points for downing that person because I've done the most work. Somebody walks up and shoots somebody that's dying on the ground. He shouldn't get the full hundred kill points, bro. That does not make sense. You did not really do any work. Also, the indication is good because what if I'm in a, a sniper fight? I'm behind cover. He's behind cover. I knock him down. I can't see him anymore. I don't know if he's not. I don't know if he's hiding. I don't know what's going on. Come on, uh, Daybreak. You need to implement that. I got me a name really do. Me too. I hope I ain't dropped mine. I'm gonna be pissed. Now let's get on to this aim acceleration. You got three options. Which should have been in the game since the beginning, but you know, I'm not here to complain. I'm here to play. And to tell you guys what's going on. Plus it's free, you know. What much can you say about a free game? Aim acceleration options. First one is linear. This is the original acceleration model. It linearly ramps your aim based on how far you push the right analog stick. Exponential. This acceleration model ramps up your aim a little faster than a linear model. High response. This acceleration model is very responsive and designed for high sensitivity players that want quick camera movements. And that's me. I have my sensitivity on 100% for everything. And I have it on high yeah, response. Shit, so, yeah, so you see all these yeah, quick on, scopes the coming in at, I hit on on from the, the imported twice, beast. I think I might one of them. Yeah, man, they should have really had yeah, this in from the beginning I feel like they lost a lot of players because they couldn't switch between their twitch shooters and this one because this was like a potato shooter and you, you move really slow you can't <laughs> if you get that analogy man 
But the main thing I need, Daybreak, if you watch this video, listen, please, put this in the game. There needs to be a dead zone adjustment option in the game. Now, I have high sensitivity. That's great. Thank you, Daybreak. But there's a point in the stick where movement is not accounted for. All my micro adjustments are not being fully inputted. There's input that I'm moving. I wish I could show you guys right here. Uh, maybe in the future I'm going to have cameras and stuff. I can show you what I'm talking about. But I'm pretty sure you get the picture. You move the stick a little bit. It does not take everything. There's a, an amount of movement before the stick actually moves. Test it out for yourself. But playing on 100% sensitivity, you will really notice it. But yeah, that would be nice if you put that in that day break. Oh man, I hope you guys are not still trying to run people over. I mean, realistically, I mean, it, you can kill somebody, but as far as gameplay, it, it's just too gimmicky to me. It, it, it requires no skill and it, it, it allows people to think that they can just stand in their car and win. So. With that being said, vehicle damage is disabled. I will repeat for all the people who didn't get that the first time. Because I guarantee I'm still going to see people out here trying to run people over. <laughs> vehicle damage is disabled. And I totally agree with that. Because it does not make sense to me. I can put a sniper M40 308 round, which is a big round, into your head and don't kill you but you can get ran over by a car and get killed and it doesn't level out doesn't equate in my mind you know so get rid of vehicle damage i'm cool no problem with that oh man we got a lot of updates and bug fixes i'm not gonna talk about all of them just the ones that stand out to me it's like the vehicle collision damage. Uh, they added a dark screen effect when your health is 20% or lower. Yeah, that's, that's something. It's alright. Oh man, quick throwing grenades. I don't know if this happened to you, but this used to happen to me all the time, and it cost me a lot of games. You go to throw a grenade. And you try to pull your weapon out and shoot a guy, but you're just standing there with nothing in your hand right after you throw the grenade for like five seconds. And you get shot. <laughs> it, it, it's, it's really, it was really frustrating. So I'm going to give you guys a plus on that. They break. I'm glad you fixed that problem. I did not have to go on the forums and complain or do anything. It was just fixing that touch. I like that. Right here is a prime example of what I'm talking about where there's no down indicator. I saw him go down, but what if that was a situation where I couldn't see him and I didn't know and I was just standing there waiting like a dumbass and I would have got popped. We got to try to eliminate these awkward and random gimmick, gimmicky situations they break. That's not something that people enjoy. Just like random bullet deviation. That should be taken out of the game too. Nobody agrees with that. I don't know why developers think that's a viable option in keeping uh, low skilled players in the game. I don't agree with that at all. I got an LMG. Who want it? Who want an LMG? You good? Yeah. Oh yeah, the airstrike grenades. Oh man, I forgot about talking about those. I smoke this those are very powerful. And you can find them in uh, tier 2 or tier 3 boxes, which is the blue, purplish color, whatever you want to call it, or the gold crate. You can find the airstrike grenade in there. My airstrike footage is coming up. 
gonna be at the end of this video. Stay tuned. If you see that? I didn't even realize I had the airstrike grenade until the last second. It looks kind of like a gas grenade. If you see a a, a a grenade that has a red line on it, it might be airstrike or it might be gas. But you better bet your ass you need to go check it. <laughs> Seriously. game has 10 million players now but well, let me be exact 10 million downloads here's a revive mechanic here takes about a good 10 seconds of an uninterrupted reviving <laughs> I tried to look around one time and canceled it out can't do that airstrike grenade right here that's exactly what it looks like I didn't even know I had it I thought it was a regular gas grenade I don't know if I picked it up off the ground meaning that it was spawned on the ground or I got it from an enemy pickup an enemy's loot bag I'm not sure but I know I fucking uh, won the game with it though They should put in the, the ability to put in ranks and the clan tag. So squads and friends can stay together. Also, leaderboards. I, mean, I don't even have to talk about that. Everybody wants that. I don't know why that's not in the game yet. I think it would be cool if we could put a ability. Uh, Goddamn. If we could put loot in the trunk of the car. It's a lot of situations where you're running around looking for armor, but if you picked up that extra one that you got from that crate and put it in the car, you'll be good. Airstrike grenade. All I can say about that is, once you throw it, just get out of there. You can't really guarantee what direction it's going to go. I've used it twice. On here, I threw it and I got Hell, the hell out of there last time I threw it I ran about a good 20-30 steps away reload, up, reload, to my crew which was behind cro like cover that. fucking airstrike wiped me and my whole crew out so oh, I got an airstrike signal. it's a hit or miss on the direction of the airstrike it comes in a straight line uh, 195, 195 in the a missile barrage Get away from that bitch! Airstrike coming in! Fall back! Fall back! Airstrike coming in! Fall back! Airstrike coming in! Oh yeah! <laughs> yeah, y'all spot what it is! Fall back! Fall back! Fall back! Everybody go! Everybody go! Boom rush! Boom rush! Let's go! Is that one of them? Yeah! One of them. Two of them! Well, that's it for me! King B! K D! King Despot is out. Peace. <laughs> hey, they was all dead. They had to go finish them. Y'all had to go finish them, right? Y'all had to finish them, right? Mitchy? Yeah, I had to finish them, yep. Yeah, yeah, I smoked all over the airstrike grenade. And he said, airstrike, airstrike. Oh, <laughs> 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 Wait, wait, wait.